The Passover festival had arrived in Israel. Even though Peter was innocent, King Herod had him arrested in order to please some of the religious leaders. Herod delivered Peter over to four squads of soldiers who put him in prison to await death. That night, Peter found himself between two soldiers, with his arms bound by two chains. He bowed his head in sleep. But suddenly, an angel of the Lord appeared and struck Peter in the side. He told the sleeping Peter to arise. The chains fell off. Peter clothed himself and followed the angel past three barriers he had to cross to escape the prison, the first guard station, the second guard station, and finally, a great iron gate that opened automatically before him to allow his escape. Peter went to the house of Mary, the mother of John Mark, where the disciples had gathered to pray for his deliverance. When the servant girl Rhoda heard Peter's voice at the door, she was so excited she ran to tell the disciples, but forgot to let Peter in. At first, the disciples wouldn't believe her. They thought she had seen a spirit. But eventually, they realized that Peter really had escaped from prison. Peter commissioned them to go and tell the good news that God had saved him from death. Does this story sound familiar? The Passover festival had arrived in Israel. Like Peter, Jesus was innocent, but the religious leaders in the temple had him arrested. In those days, another King Herod, Herod Antipas, ruled. With Herod's approval, Jesus was delivered over to four soldiers to be crucified. On the cross, Jesus hanged between two criminals, with his arms stretched out to each side. He bowed his head in the sleep of death, and a Roman spear struck him in the side. Jesus then passed three days in the grave, three barriers between him and his escape from death. But after three days, God delivered Jesus from death and sent an angel to proclaim, He has arisen. That morning, Jesus appeared to several women at the tomb, including Mary Magdalene and Mary, the mother of James. They ran to tell the disciples, but the disciples wouldn't believe them. When Jesus appeared to the disciples that evening, at first they thought he was a spirit, but eventually they realized that Jesus really had escaped from death. Jesus commissioned them to go tell the good news that he is able to save all of us from death.